class today we will see the concept percentage composition today we will discuss percentage composition of an element percentage composition or mass percentage is also known as mass percentage mass percentage of an element is the mass percentage of mass of an element divided by total percentage okay that means the mass of an element divided by total mass of the compound into 100 okay hmm? that means the total mass of an element present in a compound is called the total mass of an element present in a compound is called mass percentage clear so if you want to calculate the mass percentage of an element x then this will give this this is a equation for that that means mass percentage of element x is equal to mass percentage of element x in a compound is equal to mass of element x divided by total mass of compound total mass of compound into 100 okay so by using this uh, formula that means mass percentage of element x is equal to mass of element x divided by total mass of compound into 100 by using this formula you can find out the mass percentage of an element x so here we can take the example of water okay here we are going to take the example water from this water we can find out the uh, mass percentage of hydrogen as well as mass percentage of oxygen so mass percentage of hydrogen is equal to equal to mass of element hydrogen it is 2 into 1 2 divided by total mass of water that is here we take atomic mass and molecular mass so here molecular mass of water is 80 so 2 by 18 into 100 okay so here hydrogen 2 into 1 so 2 is or, or or you can write 2 into 1 divided by 18 into 100 that is equal to 11 oh into 11 percentage 11 oh into 11 percentage that is a percentage of hydrogen atom in water or hydrogen in water okay so now we can find out the percentage of oxygen so here we have hydrogen and oxygen only uh, so you can find out by this method 100 minus uh, 11.11 it is equal to 88.89 percentage okay right by this method also we can find out or by our actual method this one mass percentage mass percentage of oxygen is equal to mass of oxygen that is 16 divided by atomic mass of oxygen is 16 divided by mass of water that is 18 16 by 18 into 100 that is equal to 88.89 percentage okay or this method also you can find out okay so mass percentage of an element is the mass of an element present in tot, uh, total mass of an element present in a compound okay that is known as mass percentage or percentage this composition of a particular element in a compound is called mass percentage or mass percentage composition okay now we are moving on to the next topic that is empirical formula and molecular formula determination of empirical and molecular formula okay determination of 
determination of empirical and molecular formula determination of empirical and molecular formula determination of empirical as well as molecular formula so first of all you should know what is empirical formula empirical formula empirical formula what do you mean by empirical formula so we have already studied the molecular formula of some compounds many compounds we have studied so what is empirical formula empirical formula is the uh, simplest method to represent a molecule or it, it gives the empirical formula gives the simplest ratio between the atoms of elements it gives the simplest ratio of atoms in a compound okay the simplest formula okay simplest uh, formula which gives us the small ratio small or simple ratio okay to gives the uh, ratio of atoms in the various molecule it is the simplest formula which gives the simplest ratio okay simplest ratio or small ratio simplest ratio of atoms in a molecule simplest ratio of atoms in a molecule so we can take the example uh, glucose glucose the actual molecular formula of glucose is C6H12O6 this is a molecular uh, formula okay of glucose so the empirical formula is CH2O so we can say that this the, the empirical this molecular formula empirical formula is CH to O. So we can say that it is the simplest ratio, simplest ratio, or simplest formula. Ratio of atoms in a molecule. That means one is to two is to one. This is the simplest ratio. So here we have six, twelve, six ratio between carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen is six, twelve, six. So the if you divide this all number by 6 uh, you get 1 is to 2 is to 1 so C is to O this is an empirical formula so empirical formula is the simplest ratio of atoms in a molecule simplest ratio uh, simplest formula that is the ratio of atoms of various elements in the molecule simplest ratio ok so Molecular formula is C6H12O6 and it is CH2O. Okay. Now, but our topic is determination of uh, empirical and molecular formula. Our topic is determination of empirical and molecular formula. If percentage composition is given, how will you find out the empirical and molecular formula of a compound? Okay, empirical and the molecular formula of a pop. So, um, first step if uh, percentage composition is given, how will you calculate the uh, empirical formula of a compound? In the first step, uh, you have to divide that percentage composition by atomic mass. Percentage composition divided by atomic mass. So you have to divide percentage composition divided by atomic mass. Then you will get relative number of atoms, which will give that will give a relative uh, number of atoms. Relative number of atoms. Okay. Relative number of atoms. Then this relative number of atoms. Uh, relative number in second step you have to divide relative number of atoms by small number or smallest number okay smallest number okay divide by the smallest number okay ah. 
they divide by smallest number. You will get simplest ratio of atoms. Simplest ratio of atoms. Simplest ratio of atoms. Okay. Then this simplest ratio of atoms, if any atom is fraction, then you have to multiply by any number or small number uh, by number to make it whole number. You have to multiply uh, any number uh, to make it whole number. Then you have to write this small uh, whole number. Okay, these numbers are subscript along with the symbols of that atoms on the right side below. Like this, that means if it is C1H2O1, like this, 1, 2. So it should be written like this as a subscript along the right, along with the symbols on the right side. Okay, of these symbols. Okay, like this, a uh, subscript. Clear. So we can write uh, empirical formula uh, like this, and we can obtain molecular formula from empirical formula. So molecular formula gives the actual number of atoms in a molecule. Molecular formula gives actual number of atoms in a molecule. So Molecular formula can be obtained by this equation. Molecular formula is equal to N into empirical formula. N into empirical formula. So here we want to calculate N. N is the ratio of molecular mass to the empirical formula mass. N is equal to molecular mass divided by I empirical formula mass empirical formula mass so is molecular if molecular mass is given from molecular uh, if if molecular mass is given from empirical formula you can find out molecular formula this is the equation for that now we can see one question from percentage composition uh, we can find out the empirical formula of a compound okay an organic compound on investigation give gives carbon 52.2 percentage oxygen 13 percentage sorry not oxygen it is hydrogen uh, it is hydrogen 13 percentage okay then oxygen 34.8 percentage okay and find out the empirical formula of the compound an organic compound on investigation gives carbon 52.2 percentage hydrogen 13 percentage oxygen 34.8 percentage find out the empirical formula of the compound so First, we need symbols. Symbols. Carbon, hydrogen, oxygen. Because along with symbols, we write the empirical formula. Then, we will write percentage 52.2. Hydrogen 30. Oxygen 34.8. Then, atomic mass. Atomic mass is equal to 12. 1, 16. Because atomic mass of carbon 12. Hydrogen 1, oxygen 16. Then percentage by atomic mass. Percentage by atomic mass. That is equal to 52.2 divided by 12. 52.2 divided by 12. That is 4.35. Four <coughs> 4 then 13 by 1 that is 13 then uh, 34.8 divided by 16 that is 2.175 now uh, you have to divide all these three numbers by the smallest number 
power these three numbers should be divided by smallest number. Here, this is the smallest number. So, that is simplest atomic ratio. Simplest atomic uh, ratio. This 4.35 divided by 2.175. That is equal to 2. Then 13 divided by 2.175. That is 5.97. Then 2.175 divided by 2.175. That is equal to 1. Is equal to 1. Okay. So, this is our number 2, 5, 1, 9, 7, 5 and 1. These are our numbers. So, this, this can be uh, written as 6 because it is very near to 6. Okay. We can round off to 6. Okay. The last column is simplest whole number ratio. Here we can write simplest whole number ratio. So, it is 2, here 6, which is 1. Okay. So, simplest ratio is 2, 6, 1. Okay. So, it is C2, H6, O1. C2, H6, O1. Or it is C2, H6, O1. The empirical formula of the compound is C2H6O. This is the way to calculate empirical formula of a compound. So today we will so today we have discussed empirical formula and molecular formula. So that is all about today's session. Thank you all.